Road Sale here. Hope you all had a lovely Christmas. At the moment in Perth it's exceptionally hot and so we're in our little summer Dachau which is Akka My Tidy Studio where we ate on Christmas Day and where we are now sleeping until the heat wave's gone. So in my little corner here I thought I'd just show you a little snapshot. I'm still wound into the, uh, the uh, cocoon strippings. Here's my little lot here and I made a little piece so it's just a tiny little beach piece but just to show you how you can put something together as a little tiny snapshot of something with very easy as long as you've got some uh, tissue techs or napkins or whatever you've got. So this is what I did. I laid down my stuff. Let's go fast as. And remember we're just working on something pretty tiny and quick. Because not only is it still about 41 or 42 in Perth, it makes you very lethargic. Ah. So just that, there it is there, just a little piece. And I'll take a piece of tissue text or take this piece that's got a bit of colour on. And I've got a few of these little beach huts that I've purchased. Um, and so they've got some stays on. And I'll just... Colour it up with black stays on. Black's the main colour that I ever use. I can stitch onto it or whatever and then pin it onto a little bit of this here. So this is some tissue text that's been dyed but you could have coloured it. So there we are. I've just missed a little bit at the top. And so we'll just tear it down a little bit here. And just to take a bit of that colour off here. And we'll pop it on here. Oof. And give it a good wetting. Because you know it's the glue in this in the cocoon strippings. This is cer Saracen that gets things going. And having done that, I'll get my bit of glad bake and give it a, a good hot iron and turn that all the way around Let's see if we can give it a little bit more wetting under here if it's cut on the front give it a good iron as I said it's just heat and liquid Gets it down. So you lift it off here and it falls back in there. Now I could do a few little things. I could add a bit of colour. It's already got some colour, but say I wanted to add a bit of sea up there and the sky and a bit of sand. And uh, there's my huts in there. And then if I take a tissue, a um, civil serviette. Peel off the bottom layers and I won't put much on it. So to get it off. Most, most serviettes have got three layers, so we need to peel off the bottom too. She says as though it's going to be easy today. Oops, that on strike too. There we go. And another layer I think has got to come off. Yep. I think I've said before, if you keep all these, you can use those as well. And say so we just take something we might just like a little beach hut. Lady, she's just relaxing. Now you'd be much more meticulous if you're doing it yourself, but I'm just showing you very quickly. So we'll just pop her down here, put her on there, wet her up. Of course, it could be tissue text that you've printed on, or stamped, or drawn, or coloured, or anything like that. So once you put the water on, there's, there's a little piece there. It's already had some stitching. It's a bit rough and ready because it's wet. Tear that off. And if I wanted to, I could get a little bit of. Okay, a little bit of 
netting on the back. So you just here, a little bit of texture that you'll see coming through. This is some scrim. Pretty roughly shod foot fold. I just want to show you the idea. I haven't got any scissors to cut it or anything. I didn't do anything with just like most of you I'm in holiday mode. And so you've got a bit of texture on the back. Now it's quite see a little bits where there's space and so on. Pair of pull it all out. And you've got a little piece that you could mount onto something else. When it's finished, you could stitch it, uh, do whatever you like. You know, this is another really good one that could be in the background for uh, something like that. Um, serviette that I've picked up somewhere. So there you are. I hope that's given you a few ideas. And if you're in West Australia, I hope you're relaxing and keeping out of the heat until it's all over. And we'll be going back into the house, into our bedroom, perhaps next week. So we'll see you later. Bye.